Hi, I'm Connie, and uh, this is my studio. I'm just getting ready for our show in the neighborhood. My neighborhood is huge. I'm thinking Calgary and surrounding area. The animals in the woods, I'm doing a few animal paintings and, and uh, treescapes and bikes right now are, are something that I'm really concentrating on. The idea of movement and of, of uh, traveling through life and you can go really fast and not look around you or you can meander slowly and take go off trail. I'm working with the idea with my brushwork of um, vibrating molecules and, and the fact that as you travel through life the people that you travel with share your vibration. When I'm looking to create a painting I'll, I'm looking for um, design and shapes and colors. Colors are almost always my, my jumping off point. Often I have so many ideas going at once like like right now I've got six or seven paintings going at once so I'll go back and forth. I'll usually work on two or three during a day. It was always what I was going to be. I remember in kindergarten standing listening to a teacher saying on my shoulder she she's doing perspective how can she she's four she, she's doing perspective <laughs> i come from a big family and all of us drew and painted and i was the youngest so i competed more than any, anybody else i think i feel like uh, this particular series is going quite a bit deeper into to my psyche and and into my thoughts about the world and <clears throat> i feel like i'm expressing them a little clearer than than I have in the past and, and making more of a statement with these than with some of my other work. I think my work speaks for itself. What I've heard from people is that it's happy. It's very happy and that's good. I'm very pleased with that because that's that's the way it should be. That's my vibration coming out in the paintings. Everybody's creative. Everybody can be creative in whatever they're doing. Everybody has an artist within them wanting to expression. So I think we're all here to create. Um, whether we're using our hands, our mind, our body, whatever. We're all here to create and to learn and to grow. Pam's work can also be described as happy. We go together well. Our styles are different and our, our sizes are definitely different, you'll see that. And we're expressing different ideas but we're both saying happy. My name is Pam Weber and we are in my little teeny tiny studio space. The show that is coming up at Blue Rock Gallery in Black Diamond is called In the Neighborhood. It's a title that Connie and I felt would encompass the work that she and I are at the moment busy preparing for the show. I looked at neighborhood, what it brings to mind, and it was community, it was rows of houses, it was trees, conversations, it's face-to-face -face interaction with people, it's dealing with specific geographical areas, but we're taking it to the level of visual conversations and painterly vocabulary. I am using patterns and I also like the use of, of bold colors. And with the show, I guess it's about bringing people together and that's a community in itself. They may see something in it that I necessarily am not aware of putting it, but it's just the connection with viewer and painting. I've always been a creative person. It's true, I started as a little kid coloring and coloring books. The means of expression has differed over the years. I've experimented with different mediums, but have settled in with acrylic paint. It's very forgiving. I just do what I do because I like to do it. And I'm thrilled that people seem to really, my work resonates with them. People are able to find um, a joyfulness, a whimsicalness, a happiness. It just seems to be pleasing to people. I think that it is important as an artist to continue to experiment and to grow. 
and every once in a while I do surprise myself when you produce something that you can't believe you actually did from you know taking some an idea in your head to transfer it down into your arm and to because I draw so I, I, I actually draw something out on my canvas or my paper and then paint into it. I think Connie and I, we complement one another very well. Our styles are not the same, but they're compatible. Her expression is very different than mine. And of course, the viewer will just have to come and see the difference. <laughs>